Welcome to Joyful Praise Fitness, where faith, fitness, and fashion meet for total balance wellness. I'm Nida Beth, and today I'm really excited because I'm going to do a crochet hairstyle. <laughs> I'm really excited. I just literally got the idea, jumped up, went to the hair store, got the stuff, and I already put the braids in my hair, braided it down. I tried to do a different braid style than I've done in the past, kind of a, it probably doesn't look a lot different, but I really did try to do something different. It's a little bulky, so kind of what you get sometimes with locks. It's not always easy to get really small braids, but um, and then of course I'm not the best braider, so you get what you get, but I think it'll work because I've done it before and it wasn't an issue. Um, I will show you the back. Like I said, I, like I said, I don't know what it looks like back there. I just try to put it up the best I can, sewed it. Um, I used a little sew kit and, um, I ran out of the dark colors, which was kind of funny. So hopefully I had to go with the next darkest color on the on on here, which was the maroon. So hopefully nobody will see that underneath. But I'm ready to go. Let's do it. Before we get into it, of course, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you're always connected and you can do this fun stuff with me. And I would love it. While we praise the name of Jesus, because that's what it's all about, right? to glorify him through our workouts and with our bodies. Okay, so I got four packs of the Passion Twist Boho Style and I'm hoping this is gonna work. I wanted something longer than my own hair. Um, I got two different colors because they didn't have all one color. So I got a four and a one B, T1B30 is what it's called. So this one's a little lighter and the four is close to my color. My hair color is kind of a weird color, but I'm hoping it will work. I don't know. We'll see. And I kind of feel like I should have got like six packs, but I'm thinking... We're going to make this work. And so I've never done a pre-looped before. It's um, pre-looped. And so I don't know. Because I hope that um, I won't have to get more of this. Because it's like, you know, I need it to cover my head. So I'm hoping that it will be more convenient. It will be a really good thing that it's pre-looped. I don't have to worry about, you know trying to measure out how much I need. But at the same time, this doesn't look like a lot. So I'm starting to hope that I won't have to go back out to the store to get more. We'll see.
All right, guys, I finally finished. It was um, an interesting go. I took about four hours to do the braiding and the sewing, sewing my hair down. That took me that long. So that was kind of a little bit longer than I had wanted. And then I kind of ran into some issues putting the hair in. I didn't have enough packs, so I was kind of concerned about that. And that actually was an issue. So I had to go run out get some more packs, come back, and then finish. Um, and then my daughter was telling me that I didn't really quite do the back very well. So if I position it a certain way, it works out. I want to, you know, keep working on it. But I figured this was good enough to show you until I can actually finish. So here's the finished look all the way around. If I... She said I need to put some more pieces like in the middle and the back, but it's very full. I didn't want it to be this full. So it is hot. It is hot. I ran this morning on my treadmill and I was, I was actually okay with the run part, but when I went outside, just, you know, to go to the grocery store and stuff like that, it was, I felt like, oh my gosh, what was I thinking? But you know, it's fun but in pictures i'm really happy i really wanted to do something different so this is the finished look you should try it out let me know what you think down below don't forget to like and share this video and i'll see you next time god bless